Who thought that an ear would be a good earring to put on an ear? This just looks weird and it's like, are you an alien? Are you real? Please don't make this a trend or otherwise I blame you internet. Maybe blame me too because I'm the one who showed you. Do not do this guys, please. The right way. She puts milk first and then the cereal. Who does milk first? Which of you guys let me does milk first? Let me know in the comments, milk or cereal? Which one do you do first? I'll tell you who. People with no appreciation for this sacred customs. In all honesty though, I don't do it, but I respect it because some people, they can't stand soggy ass shit. And you know what's gonna happen to your cereal? If you put milk on top of it, it's gonna get soggy and some people don't like that. So I respect this for the love of crunch. Crunch, crunch. Now this, I cannot stand behind. Who eats pizza like this? You eat it with the crust first so you don't get the cheese and greasiness on your fingers. Now you have not, ugh, and the crust is the worst part. Like, I guess I can respect it in that sense because like you want to save the best for last, but now you're filling up on crust. What if you don't have time to eat all the cheesy pepperoni goodness? <sighs> Who raised you? Happy one day anniversary to the best girlfriend out there. Happy one day. This has to be a joke, right? Who would tweet this? I've literally had stomach flus that have lasted longer than their relationship. Stomach flus, longer than, lo at least wait a month, am I right? Like you're counting days and then you're like, happy two day anniversary, happy three day anniversary. What if you guys stay together forever? You're gonna be celebrating every single day? To park in LA, you literally have to solve a damn rival, ri river, riddle. Look at this. No parking 8 to 10, but no stopping 4 to 6. Parking 2 hours from 8 to 4, 6 to 8, 8 to 8. Damn, this is... How do you, So when can you park, guys? I, can, I can't figure... I mean, I could figure this out, but like they said, you just sit there and really think about it. Whoever cut this cake shouldn't be allowed near cakes again. Cake needs to get a restraining order on this person because then what happens what happens to the person that wants to eat this slice their slice is all weird and abnormal this person's slice like they get this really long slither what it what oh what about this person they have to get a triangle now because what about this person right here what is this shape you are screwing up everybody around you everybody around you you're screwing up all their cake oh no oh no oh no oh no oh no guess guess who does this to the bagel who does this to a bag? Who, who? This is not, this is not how you cut it. I can literally, <sighs> it's not properly distributed. First of all, how do you eat this properly? Second of all, only a little bit of it gets peanut butter and jam. You want it to be evenly distributed throughout the whole bagel. I am so upset also about this caption, bangles. Who likes to eat bangles? Also, isn't bagel one G? Just saying. I'm so upset. I'm so upset by this picture. When you're old and you don't give a fuck. <laughs> She's like, I'm going to take up this whole aisle and no one can pass. Like, look, look at everybody. Everybody's like, uh, okay, uh, like literally, I mean, I mean, I'm not hating because, you know, got to respect your elders. But I mean, she, she could be holding on with this arm and put this arm down and let people pass. But she's like, nope, going to put my bag down, going to put my arm across and nobody can go through. If I can't walk. Nobody can else can walk because that's how it's gonna be from here forever from now on This is what happens every time anyone opens a sweet roll. No, the poor chocolate This uh -huh. and like everybody knows usually like the outside of something is the best part Like let's be honest. This looks dry. Like I don't want to eat this I want to eat the outside, but yet the outside's getting stuck in the plastic wrapping. I mean like you could just lick it off Lick it off, yeah. I would do that, but it's it's a little it's a little inconvenient. Like you want to eat it together and enjoy the, the the taste together. Can can these companies just figure it out? Is this a mass grave for chairs? I have never seen so many chairs in my life. Who? How how did the? Uh, this is so confusing. What if they all fall down? What about this this man? Isn't he scared for his life? Isn't he scared that this, the cause of death will be chairs? And why do people not care about their chairs? Poor little chairs. Am I right, guys, or am I right? Because this, this is too much. This house literally cannot contain the amount of stuff that its owner is hoarding. What? How does this even happen? Is this the house just being 
being built bad or is this like let's shove as much shit as we can into it this is ridiculous i've never seen this in my life like i'd be terrified to even walk close to that house what about the house next to it shouldn't this house be scared of this house the people who live here should be afraid of this house what if this house collapses and it takes down the other houses this is literally a danger to everybody who's near this vicinity oh are you serious Is this for real? Maybe they're just trying to show off the outfits. But do they not realize that this looks like children are hanging? Like that's literally what it looks like. You got the shoes, you got the pants, you got the top, you even got hair. This is too realistic. Like this is why you hang <laughs> clothes separately. Maybe don't put it on a mannequin. Maybe just hang the shirt and the pants flat. Can we not? Like, this is just so unsettling. Nobody wants to walk into, sh into a store and see this. And look, it's all over the store. Like, they probably just have way too many clothes and they want to show it all off. But like I said, just put it on a hanger without the mannequin. Literally, that's all they need to do to make this a little bit better. Please, do you guys think this is weird too? Because I think this is strange. Interior design at its finest. This just looks really... Um not good like what if it becomes outdated what if it breaks now you're gonna have to replace it your new microwave is gonna be a different size it's not gonna fit in that hole then what are you gonna put in that hole what are you gonna put in that ugly hole it's just this random hole in your house now with no microwave and uh, just just a hole like this makes no sense you couldn't you couldn't put it on the countertop that's where most people put their microwaves countertops somewhere not just like in the middle of a cement Pillar? Am I right, guys? Ugh. When your bread has no soul, <laughs> your soul is bread. This is like when you get robbed. Like, you get a nice big piece of bread, and you're so excited, you're gonna put some peanut butter and jam on that bread. You know what I'm saying? You're gonna peanut butter and jam. And then you go there and you cut open your bread. And you can't even spread. Like, how are you gonna spread any peanut butter or jam or butter? Or I'm like, I said it weird. Or butter, or Nutella, or whatever you want on it. You're not because this bread is useful for nothing. Like you can use this. The only the only function I can see for this bread that's useful is like dipping it into soup or into dipping into stuff. That's fine. But if you want to use this for a sandwich, you know all your sandwich stuff's gonna fall through the hole. <sighs> When your dog is not your best friend. <gasps> ah, he's like, I'm just trying to suntan. I'm just trying to suntan. The dog is like, get off. Literally pushes the boy off. And then he just lies on there. And he's like, <laughs> it's mine now. But look how cute. We can't be mad. Look at that face. Let's just look at this face. You can't even be mad. Guys, I'm, I just have like a soft spot for puppies and dogs. I call them all puppies, even if they're massive and old. I'm just like, puppy. But look at his face. He's like, no, the water's cold. Don't do this. The dog's like, you're going under, going down. They had one job. Seriously, what's this What's this sink doing? How is this? How? Hello? 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 Like, this is just going to make the floor all wet. The poor person who has to clean this bathroom is gonna be mopping for the rest of their days. They're gonna be mopping forever. They're just gonna become a mop at this point. Like you have no other life destiny, like you are one with the mop. Because this floor will always, people either have to have dirty hands or the floor is gonna be soaked. <laughs> Guys, this is supposed to drain the water. But somebody messed up and for some reason around the drain, the stone is raised. It's supposed to go the opposite way. It's supposed to dip so that all the water goes down. But now, everywhere is flooded and no water is draining down the actual drain. Hmm. That's not very handy, is it? No. Not handy at all. Like, what are you doing? People, people who built this? Hello? Hello? What? How did they not leave me an explanation? I want to know how the hell this car got up there. How, how did this person manage to do this? Does anybody know? Can somebody tell me how this happened? Because I, I, I need to know. This is how, how. Well, there you have it, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. I love you all so much.
You're cute. Bye.